Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. Today is the day where we go up to New York. We are traveling there to visit family. But we are driving up from Florida to New York. We're actually gonna be stopping twice. We're gonna be stopping in Fayetteville, North Carolina and Philadelphia, Pennsylvania because we have to charge the car very, 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 very many times. We also have our cats with us. So they're in here. I don't know if you could really see them. Mulchi and Zara and then they have their litter box. This should be interesting this is our first time doing this with them we have taken them on planes before and the plane was just delayed and it wasn't really a good situation so now we kind of have a little bit control over their well-being and Haruki's driving we actually were gonna like go to sleep and then wake up but we were laying in bed and we couldn't fall asleep so we're like do you want to just go now and <laughs> we're going now so it is currently 3 8 a.m we have the car battery on 94 percent so let's see how far we can take this and see Let's go. So we had to stop in Jacksonville to charge the car. I have like everything all over me <laughs> and my legs are like to this side and my back is just not doing so well. So we gotta figure this situation out. The way Haruki is laying Ouch. right now. <laughs> I can't find a spot to fit in. <laughs> this is not bad. I don't know if I'm gonna be able to sleep. We're gonna try. <laughs> that light is fucking bright. It's on my face. <laughs> I know. I don't think that's gonna help, babe. <laughs> it's so chill. So I think I slept like an hour or two, but my Fitbit didn't catch how long I was sleeping at all. I'm so tired, though. 7.33 a.m. We're at our second charging stop. How's it going? Mochi's in between the cat litter. <laughs> Mochi. Mochi bear. <laughs> Why you... She literally oh, no. squishes herself. Cause Zara's taking up the whole space. Zara, you can't go on top of Mochi. Please don't. No. So we just got Starbucks. I got them tea pink drink and a bacon gouda, or not a bacon gouda, a double smoked bacon. I'm gonna eat this. And we are in South Carolina right now. We're making pretty good timing, not hitting too much traffic. Um, my eyes are like kind of puffy because I'm tired, but yeah, Haruki's been driving the whole time. Not too bad. He's checking his stocks now. So I moved the litter box and put mochi there. Zara is now in a little bit of time out, but we only have like about 40 minutes until the next charging stop so i just had to because mochi was literally being squished by the litter box i don't know if it was voluntarily or zara was <laughs> mad at her or something for not giving her space so mochi can have some space Zara's eating. I have to give her her insulin. She's a diabetic. I have to keep her insulin cold. So I bought this thing. It's still cold. So like, I think it's gonna stay cold for the next hour or so, which I'm really happy about. This is her little insulin bottle. We took her out of her carrier and now she sees the whole outside world. Now she wants to go outside. I've never done this in a car before. Sterilize it. Here's the needle. If you don't like needles, skip to the next part of the video. Hopefully she lets me do this easily. No, yeah, she knows what's gonna happen. Come on, you need to eat your food, please. I love you, that's why I'm doing this. I don't think she felt that very much. Good girl. Now, I'm putting her back in. Oh my God, she's fighting with me. Her hair's caught in a zipper. Zara, eat your food. I got her back in there. Eat your food, baby. I'm sorry. Yeah, yeah sorry. Yeah, we're like in the middle of nowhere, so. <laughs> Are you from here? No, I'm actually from uh, Greensboro, and it's in Florida. Oh, nice. We're coming from Florida. Really? Yeah. Florida, Florida. Orlando. Orlando, 
vlogs? Yeah. Okay. Going up to New York. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I'm gonna write it down. I'll make sure I follow you guys. My name is Nick. What's your guys' name? Kayla and Haruki. Haruki. Right. Kayla and Haruki? Yeah. yeah. Okay, I'm gonna look you guys up. Um, I'll write it down. Thank you. Thank you. He was like beeping the horn while I was giving her insulin. I didn't know he was beeping at me. Yeah. And then I looked and I'm just like, what's this guy want? <laughs> he was very patient because I think he was there for a bit. <laughs> I just got out of this store called Stuckies. I think there's a Dairy Queen in there, but I actually didn't even see it. My dad told me to get salted pecans. Apparently it's a Southern thing. I had no idea. So I found this pecan log roll. I found a whole package. Guess how much these were? That? Yeah. Like 20? Yeah. <laughs> like who pays $20 for pecans? I do, but aren't they like a natural thing? What happened? I don't know. Zara clawed you? Oh, oh my gosh, it hurts. I'm sorry. That don't look so good. I think it's about time we leave. Damn. Two hours and 26 minutes what left to traffic. drive. That's crazy. We'll be there like a little bit early. All right, oh. let's do it before I get tired. Let's go. All right, we just stopped in South Carolina. South of the border is going to be soon. So two hours and... 28 minutes until we are at our Airbnb. We are currently in so much traffic in Florence, South Carolina. We actually don't know like how bad it actually is because it's all like flat land, but we've been sitting here for quite a bit. There's actually like trucks making U-turns where you're not supposed to be making U-turns back there. So I assume they probably got a call from like other truck drivers. I don't know if it's construction, an accident or what. We don't really have to be anywhere at a certain time. So like we got time until we have to check in our Airbnb. We don't have to check in at two, but we got time because we're running a little bit early. So kind of works out. It's currently 11.48 a.m. We'll let you guys know when we're out of this traffic. Our Tesla doesn't really tell us with the traffic, so I'm gonna see on Apple Maps, cause there's like a lot of people turning, so I'm gonna see like how bad. Ooh, it says an hour and 28 minutes. Look at that traffic all the way here. Oh, if you If you go off the road, it's more, so. That red line is all the traffic. It's only 27 miles, but it's gonna be an hour and 28 minutes to get to the south of the border. We're still on the fastest route, even with the traffic. There's other people, they probably just don't wanna sit in the traffic, but we have to go through this traffic either way. The road that we need to take is like past this traffic anyway, so we have to, oh my gosh. It's so like, I don't know if you guys can see it, but like it is far up there. I don't know if I could like zoom in when I'm editing, but like, wow. Like as far as you can see, there's traffic. That's crazy. Update at 11.57 a.m. Looked on Apple Maps and it looks like there's a flood warning on the road that we're on. I don't know how that happened. It must have rained earlier, but I don't see any clouds in the sky or like maybe sewer came up or river. I don't know, something flooded on the throughway, which is weird. This road, like 95, what we're supposed to be on, we just like recalibrated like our thing and we're supposed to be here, but it's gonna take us all the way over here. But at least it's 34 minutes now and not an hour and a half. Hello, Mr. Spidey. Mm -hmm. You can stay out there. Oh, we're still stuck in traffic by the way, but quick story time. We were coming back from Taco Bell, like down the road from where we lived, and there was a spider like crawling on the dash. It was probably like a spider, well, I don't know where he went, but probably like around that side. But it was like black, and I like freaked out. Like I saw it, and I'm like, oh, where'd he go? And I like, my seatbelt was still on, and I was already in the back seat with my seatbelt on. Like I forced myself in the back seat. Like I jumped, like flew back there. I screamed, I think I screamed really loud and we were like at a red light. I wonder if anyone heard me, but it was so funny. And then I stayed in the back seat until we got home. I never know you could move that fast. I'm less scared of bugs now. I used to be really afraid of spiders and stuff. It was so quick, it was like 0.5 seconds. Yeah. Go boom. <laughs> yeah, guys, we're still in traffic. It's been over an hour, 12.37 p.m. And I mean, that says 37 minutes, but let's be real, it's probably gonna be longer. It's the truck behind we didn't... us is getting really Yeah, cold. he's been like tailgating us literally. And it's like this semi truck. He's been getting really close to us, like closer than, yeah, look. He's coming up. We'll update you when we're out of this traffic. We haven't seen any flood yet. There's no clouds in the sky, so we have no idea what's going on. Okay, it looks like the right lane is closed and they want us to merge left. We're already in the left lane, so I guess this lane is the only lane available. About a mile later, prepare to stop. Check back in at the station. Kayla, that's it for now. We got an arrow, that's all we got. So we got 
that cop. I saw like a, a tire back there. Yeah, I don't really know what's going on. He's just sitting there. Yeah, I don't know. There's a tow truck. That's where the contractors were going. Are you kidding me? Is this it? That's all there so. was? Are you kidding? Yeah, really? Like cleaning the that this was it. So you're telling me we waited like two hours no. for construction? What? Oh my god. Whatever. <laughs> <laughs> Glad it's over. <laughs> we are almost there. Finally. We're at our Airbnb. We are extremely tired. Rookie's laying over there. When we got here, Mochi literally was like behind this and she was like stuck back there. It was really scary. I didn't film it because it was actually really scary, but like I was so scared that she was just stuck back there. I don't know how she got back there. It was hard to get her out, but Haruki got her out. I'll give a tour of the place in a little bit. I'm just like super tired right now. We ordered Papa John's, so we're just waiting on that. We're probably gonna sleep after because we're exhausted <laughs> and it's only 3 p.m. But we didn't sleep last night really, so. <laughs> everyone it is day two of our road trip next stop is philadelphia i've never been in the city of philly before so i'm super excited to like kind of look and see what it's like the cats actually woke me up again well zara did she's been waking me up lately i really haven't gotten much sleep so i am literally super tired but i'm gonna get a pink drink this morning hopefully wake me up for the ride and i just filmed a bikini video and then like, some only fan stuff so now I'm gonna pack and get ready to pack the car up again. I have to wake Haruki up. I don't know if he's awake. Um, it is currently 8.51 and we have to be out of here by 11. Um, I don't know if we're gonna leave earlier or if we're gonna leave at 11. Check-in at our next Airbnb is at 4. So yeah, we've got time. Um, I think it's about like a 7 hour drive. So we'll probably get there after check-in. I think it's actually a 7, 8 hour drive with charging the car. Um, charging the car has actually been nice for the road trip. You know, like people think that sucks you have to charge the car like every two hours but it's actually nice to like get a break and it doesn't take that long to charge it's been pretty nice it's been a really chill road trip and it's been nice to hang out in the car with Haruki and the cats um i'll show you the airbnb a little bit a little messy now since we have all our stuff in here cars out there i have to show you like the garage it's so freaking cute and then you walk in here and there is the couch my bikinis are right there with my ring light and stuff um but there's the couch i think it's so adorable i absolutely love the pillows so much much. And yeah, this is an overview of the Airbnb we stayed in. The best thing about this Airbnb is that there was no pet fee and no cleaning fee. I am gonna leave a tip for the cleaning and stuff, but there was no fees for that. It was super cheap. It was like a hundred bucks. This is where I took my nap yesterday, but um, this is one of the bedrooms. Um, this is my outfit for the day. It's just a white fox little set. Love this shirt and pants. So freaking cute. Yeah, this setup is so cute. I love it. I'm not gonna show you in there, but the cats are in there with Haruki. He's sleeping right now. Oh my God, this is where Mochi got stuck yesterday. It was super, super scary. And then this is the bathroom. I love the lighting in here. It was really nice to do my makeup in here. This is the shower. This Airbnb is clean for the most part, but I am happy that they didn't charge a cleaning fee because the shower was pretty, I mean, it wasn't that dirty, but like it definitely needed to be wiped down. And um, there was like hairs in there. <laughs> Like, what the heck? Um, but everything else in the Airbnb was Gucci. I'm excited to hit the road again. My Starbucks because I'm super hungry and I need to wake up because I got like three hours of sleep. I fell asleep at one, woke up at like, I don't know what time. So we're about to leave now. This lighting actually is not good, but we're about to leave now and I'm actually just waiting for Zara's insulin cooler to cool down because otherwise it's gonna freeze. Probably like another five minutes or so. And then we're gonna hit the road. It is 9.56 and I'm so hungry i think i'm gonna get two sandwiches at starbucks i'm so so hungry but yeah we're going from fayetteville to philadelphia and tomorrow it'll only be like a four to six hour car ride that's pretty good place was super cute it's really nice because they had a car charger so we were able to charge our car for free we've had to stop so many times to charge it which i don't mind but it is really nice that that was here that way we don't have to charge the car before we go i'm gonna go get the insulin cooler we'll go in one last time the angel numbers are out so this was 333 which is really cool i don't think i showed you guys that 
princess, but this is where me and Haruki slept. I absolutely love the chakra thing. Let's go. There's 333 bear, another angel number. How can I get started for you today? Hi, can I get a venti pink drink with light ice and no strawberries? The light ice and no strawberries. And can I also get a bacon gouda? Bacon gouda. And a double smoked? Uh, I'll get a double smoked bacon. And uh, can I get the venti medicine bowl with honey? You said a venti what, sir? Medicine bowl with honey. So we're actually out of the of the teas that we need for the honey citrus mint tea, but we can do a mint majesty and still put the lemonade and the peppermint and the uh, honey on that. Okay, I'll try that one. And those would be two double smokes, right? Yes. Yes. And what size would you like the tea? Uh, venti, right? Venti, yeah. All right, that's gonna be twenty nine eleven. Thank you. Is it possible to take the strawberries out? Yes. Thank I'm you. so sorry, yeah, the, sorry. the sticker says it. I don't know what That's happened. Right. I feel bad, but I just really don't like <laughs> strawberries. Yeah. Yeah. Well, I like strawberries. I don't like their strawberries. Is it good? Oh, That's so bad. Really? You don't like it? Yeah. Would you like any napkins? Can you also actually just tend to something out? I really don't like it. I'm sorry. Okay, let me go. <laughs> oh my god, it's so what bad. What is it? The mint is so strong. Oh, you don't like mint? Yeah. Do you? Okay, what would you like in the I'll get a strawberry refresher. Strawberry refresher yeah, with lemonade I, or water? Uh, with lemonade. Sorry? With lemonade. Lemonade. Yeah, thank you. We're usually not this difficult. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Thank you so much, I appreciate it. Yeah, no, all right. Oh, yes. Thank you. 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 Thank I usually ask them to remake it, even though it's uncomfortable. You know, I pay like six dollars for a drink. Yeah. <laughs> I'm gonna enjoy it, you know, so I'm dipping out of my comfort yeah. zone. I feel, I always feel so bad, but I did ask for no It was a good call, honestly. I was gonna take it, but yeah. like, I, I need to say something. Otherwise, Yeah, because like, if you don't like it, and it was a new drink that they offered to you, you didn't like ask for that. Well, I, oh yeah, that's the thing. Yeah. Like, no, that was a new drink that they offered me, so it felt more comfortable. A little bit like okay, I guess. Yeah. The taste of mint was so strong. I was like, there's no way I can drink this. Got a double smoked bacon, and I also got a bacon gouda. I got two sandwiches because I'm super hungry. I barely ate anything last night. So apparently Zara got out of that carrier by herself. I knew it was like kind of open. But I didn't think she could like fit through. She must have unzippered it by herself. Haruki ended up texting me saying Zara got out by herself. And I like got it as I'm coming out with my frozen chocolate I got from Duncan. And I see the text and I just start running towards the car. I'm like, why is he sitting in the car if she's out? I'm like, I was like confused, but she was on his lap. But she's so like all over the place like she won't sit still she wants to constantly be moving around in this car this is why you need to be in a cage calm down you need to stay put yesterday she like rolled down the window when he like remember she rolled down the window on your side yeah and i'm like i'm like that's probably why she was found on the throughway why we got her like she probably rolled down the window and jumped out or something let's not manifest that but like yeah what are you doing you're a throughway kitty, aren't you? Don't stress mommy out. Mochi is just literally laying in the litter box. We're in uh, North Carolina still. It's it's a long state to get through. We have two hours and 21 minutes until we're at the next supercharger, and I think that's in Virginia, so. Gonna stay here forever, Zara? Okay. So right now we've been stopped for a while. We just got to Virginia. Zara is panting. I've given her food. She ate a little bit, but she's not drinking water. She's not hot. I think she's just super anxious and it's making me anxious. Like her mouth is open, like as if she's a dog. And Mochi's just literally chilling. We have a long time to go. That's the thing. I can't have her like panting this long. That's not healthy. So I think she should be fine, but yeah, she's panting again. And she got out of that carrier by herself. So now I think I have to put her in this carrier, but still like freaking out like I was holding her and we had to stop because she was literally like freaking out like trying to get all over the car and stuff and we've only been driving for a couple hours. It wasn't like this yesterday. I think she's just really stressed now. She doesn't know what's going on. We'll see. It's 1.34 right now. I think we stopped about probably a half hour ago. <laughs> she wanted to be down there. <laughs>
of our road trip. We are going soon. Mochi is trying to hide anywhere she possibly can. They are eating now, or at least Mochi's supposed to be eating. I don't really like all this stuff here because she keeps getting into it. Mochi, if you don't eat your food, I'm gonna put you in your carrier right now, so eat. She's usually good at listening, so. Zara, on the other hand, she does her own thing. But this place was so cute, honestly. Absolutely loved it, so cute. And we got a little fireplace over here. But we're in Philly now, and we have to go to upstate New York, four to five hour drive to upstate New York, maybe six with charging and stopping. I'm not sure, we'll see. Shouldn't take too long as long as travel Traffic isn't bad. I also have like an integration call for my ayahuasca ceremonies. Mochi, I'm gonna put you in your carrier. <laughs> Stop. Eat your food. You're gonna starve. I just had to fight Mochi to put her in her carrier. Yeah, I have an integration call on the way. Unfortunately, I have to be in the car while I do it because it's scheduled, but I feel like I have kids. <laughs> oh my god, technically I do. These little babies. But I have an integration call. That's all. Okay. I'm not gonna talk about it anymore because every time I try to talk about it, the cats are doing some crazy shit. So, I'll see you in the car. <laughs> oh my gosh. Yeah, you're right. I need to adjust you so mommy can fit her legs in here because you have to be such a difficult cat. I had to take Zara out of the big carrier because she learned how to get out yesterday and I don't want that happening again. So, Mochi has the big carrier all to herself and I think she's loving it a lot more. I got my venti pink drink with my bacon gouda today. I didn't have the double smoked bacon so I got the gouda. Okay, so we made it to New York. We just are in Albany right now, so we're not too far from my mom's. My grandma's there tonight, which is nice, but my mom's on a cruise, so I'm not gonna see her tonight. She'll be there tomorrow. But yeah, I've had a lot of realizations after the integration phone call, which was really crazy, but I'm feeling a lot better about things, and yeah, let's go to my mom's. <laughs> Jersey City again, but we went to the smoke shop that I used to go to and it's permanently closed. Now I gotta find somewhere else to get it. I'll sell it on the street. Yeah, but I don't really want to get it on the street here. We'll find a place. Tilt it a little bit. Like tilt the camp. Yeah, there you go. Add some character to it. Surprise, surprise. I know. We were just in Florida. We took a three day road trip and now we're here in New York. Yeah, we're celebrating 420 today and I haven't smoked in like four months, I think, but yeah. I'm going to today. So, Haruki is interviewing people for his channel, 420, and yeah, let's go. It's gonna be fun. <laughs> He's gonna go to sleep. We're in Central Park. So I have the option between a sativa and a hybrid. And earlier I wanted the sativa, but I'm kind of leaning towards the hybrid now. I haven't smoked in like four months. It's interesting because, well, it was just uh, 420, by the way. And what was I gonna say? I wanted to say this before I even smoked, but here we are. Shit, I was literally looking for this. Anyways, um, I used to like going to smoking without setting an intention, like I would just smoke five pretty much. Now, ever since I like did ayahuasca, I kind of want to do everything with an intention. My intention for this sesh is love, to feel more 
love and gratitude and to show appreciation to the plant because I honestly never did in a way that I wanted to, so yeah.